The probationary period is a key tool within the performance management life cycle. It's an excellent opportunity for both the employer and the employee to assess if they're a right fit for each other. It's important, however, for the employer to remember if you do want to invoke the probationary period, then it needs to be in writing. It needs to be within the employee's main terms and conditions of employment. What's the key elements that should be in a probationary period policy? Firstly, how long should it be? We would recommend six months. Anything more may be a little bit unreasonable. And it's a good opportunity, a good time frame for both you and the employee to assess each other. The second thing we would recommend that to have mid-period reviews so that the employee knows if they're falling short of the mark. So set them targets, give, make your expectations really clear. And if they're not performing, ensure they're given an action plan and an opportunity to improve. If they get to the end of the six months and they're still falling short of the mark, you need to ensure that you do follow a process if you are moving to termination of the probationary period.